Hey what is up guys, my name is Rizyle, and welcome to another video on how to remodel a Minecraft village. In this episode, we will be remodeling the church, which in my opinion looks more like a basic tower, as there's not really any features that distinguishes it as a church. So with that being said, let's get right into the tutorial. First up, we're going to widen the back end of the church. So from either side of the building, go over 5 blocks and extend 3 cobblestone blocks out like so. Then go over 6 blocks and add another cobblestone row. Now copy these two rows of cobblestone over to the opposite side. Next we will make sloped walls out of these cobblestone rows. So make the outer block 4 blocks high. The middle block will be 5 blocks high and the inner block will be 6 blocks high. Now apply this same sloping pattern to the other three walls as well. For the two walls that touch the building, extend this sloping pattern up like so. Then add cobblestone stairs on top of all these walls. Next we'll add a roof between the walls we just placed. So go in one block from the top of the wall and begin placing the stairs across like so. Just continue this upwards until you have 4 rows of stairs on each side. Now close off the gap at which the roof connects with oak slabs. Next we will close off the back wall. So start by connecting the two walls at the top as I do here. Now we are going to build a circular extension off the back known as an apse. So start by placing two 4 block high walls of cobblestone at each inner edge. Then build two 5 block high walls over and out a block from the last two. And then connect them at the top. Also place a block behind these two walls like so. Next close off the remainder with a 3 block wide wall that is 4 blocks high. Now we'll build a roof over top of this extension. So using oak stairs, planks and slabs, follow along on how I install this roof. Also add a window between this gap using a glass pane, and then finish off the roof by adding stairs along the side here. Now 
Next, we will close off the side walls. So begin by adding two rows of cobblestone underneath the oak stairs. Then at the bottom, add a row of cobblestone that is in one block. And then place a wall at each end. The remaining gap we will fill with stained glass panes, so I'm going to use a combination of purple, green, and cyan panes. However, you can use whichever colors that you want. Once one side is complete, we can simply copy this over to the other side. Next up, we will edit the tower portion of the church. So first fill in this front section with cobblestone so that the face is flat. Then add a 3 block column at each end. Place stairs on the top and then connect the two columns. Next, add two cobblestone stairs at the entrance. Now going around to the sides, we'll first fill in the bottom gap with cobblestone. Then make a four high wall with a stair at the end. Once you have one side complete, do the same for the other side. Also go back and add a window at each end. Next, we are going to build a bell tower at the top. So start by adding a cobblestone block and stair at each tip. We'll then connect these at the top using cobblestone, and then place an upside down stair at the bottom of each one. Now let's add a bell by placing an oak fence and gold block here at the center. Lastly, to top off the bell tower, we'll add a cross using oak planks, and then that will be all for the exterior. Next up, let's head inside to renovate the interior. So at the sides of the entranceway, let's start by getting rid of the blocks around the small window and place upside down oak stairs as a counter. Then we'll have to get rid of most of the default interior to fit the new dimensions. So knock down all of the walls beginning at the end of these ladders. We are now left with a much more spacious room, so let's first fill in the rest of the floor with cobblestone. Next cover over the oak planks at the back of the ceiling with cobblestone.
Now we'll add in the seats of the church, or as they are also known as the pews. Basically, they should be installed so that there is a nice aisle at the middle and the sides of them. Next, we'll add in the altar. So using upside down quartz stairs, place this altar at the center here. Then add some white carpet on the top of it. Behind the altar, let's add some redstone torches to serve as candles. Then place a painting between them, so just cycle through the paintings until you get to the portrait of this guy here. Next, let's add a simple little chandelier. So at the top, place two oak fences and a cobblestone block, then surround it with torches. The bottom floor is now complete, so let's head up to the second level. Up here we will build a small balcony over top the first floor. So start by knocking out this inner window, then use cobblestone to extend the platform out two blocks. Also add oak planks at the sides, and then place fences at the end. Once the balcony is installed, that will be all for the interior of the church. So that is going to be it for this tutorial. Thank you so much for watching, and if you are interested in remodeling your entire Minecraft village, be sure to check out the other parts of this series as well. As always, any feedback and rating is much appreciated, and I hope to see you guys in the next video. Later guys, bye bye.